All right, guys, Clipper is one of the best online platform where you can sell and buy your online business. So in this video, I'm going to show you, you know, this is step by step, how to sell your website on Flipper. So the first thing you want to do is you want to register your account, go to Flipper.com. So you want to look for Flipper.com and register your account. You sign up and you are going to verify your account so then you are ready to go so when you are on the front end of the flipper the home page right here so if you want to sell website you can go here if you want to search for for website any website you can just type here or you can show from here and see all the business all the website that are on for sale so so i want to buy i want to set my website so we want to go here i want to click sell now so right there so from there you can be able to to sell your website so so when you click sell now they're going to present you with this box here so you're going to enter your website so when you enter your website you're going to click continue so when you click continue you are going to present you're going to be presented with this box here so you want to tell the you want to tell FIPA about your website already so you can set everything up so you enter the name of your of your business here and the day that you created your website so right there you enter the year here and fill up everything here where you where you are operating where is your location of the website in which state of your e base in which industry do you operate in this type of website you are briefed so you are going to complete all this and when you finish then hit continue we are going to check some of this if it, if you make money with art if your website make money already with art if not you can leave it if you make money with affiliate you can take affiliate if it make money with subscription, you can take it. If it is other means of monetization you are using on your website, you can just take here and continue. So now they want to know which of this product you use, which of this company you use to monetize your website. So if you are using AdDrive, you take it. If you are using Ezoic, if you are using Threadbooks, if you are using Google Ad. You will tick the one that you are using here. Google Analytics, if you are using Google Analytics on your website, Media Vine, Numeric, Monometric, Pioneer, PayPal, Book, Revolution. So, in all these companies, you are going to choose the one that you are using on your website to monetize your website. So, when you finish with that, and you are going to continue. So here yeah, they want to see the performance of your website. So based on the, the thing that's to tick, so you are going to connect it with your accent. You want to connect the you want to connect Flipper with your accent. So you're going to give them the code of the email address of your of the accent that you use and the Google Analytics, so they want to see your Google Analytics. You are going to connect. They want to connect with your Google Analytics. And if you are using PayPal also, or Stripe, so you give them the, the address and they will automatically connect with your account. So when you finish, you are going to hit continue. So here is the revenue and expense. So they want to know your if you are able to provide monthly financial for the for the buyer so so if not you can provide annual data monthly data is the best way you trust with buyer so yeah you can scroll down there and based on the money that your website is making so if your business is making money you can just tap it here yeah. how much money it's not from the month how much money did your website did your business make in april in may in june and you type it here 
uh, expense uh, the expenses of the of the website if you have some expenses that you spend or all the money that you spend on the website so in may you can type it here so month by month month by month so just type it there and you are ready to go now and finish you click continue down here so we don't also want to know what is your primary expense of the website so if you have hosting so you can tell them how much you are spending on how much is the hosting that you are using so if you are you are a content writer you can tell them how much you are paying for the content writers to do the job for you if you have, if you have some plugins that payment plugins on your website you can just tell them how much it costs so so we are going to fill in all this box here so when we finish you going to continue again so here they want to know what asset are included in the set so you are going to tell them what are you selling you are selling the domain website file brand asset logo if you are also selling the email you can take it if you are selling social media with your website you can tick this place here yeah. if you are selling email address subscriber list you can tick here if you are selling inventory you have something in stock of the website you can tick here phone numbers supplier contractor trademark agent custom technology and others so when you finish it's your current it's your content you need, also want to know if it's a content content unique or or not so say yes yes your design is unique so if you are going to provide possible support just take yes here yeah. so as you can see i've take all the time yes then you are going to continue so here is our social media account so you have social media accounts to include on the sale so you can just add the url there and you tell them how many followers you have on the on the facebook if it's facebook instagram twitter interest you tell them how many followers tiktok or the youtube an email if you have email so you tell them here you list how many followers how many email subscribers you are you type it on the box here on the box here so when you finish you are going to eat continue down below so here is the summary of your of your website of your business so here is where you're gonna provide some the summary of your of your business so just go to write something about your website so this is going to come out at the top of the or the front end when just anybody want to buy your website so like this one here like this one of my website that i want to sell here so this is site on three years age domain value at parent niche and digital products included in this set is it around 21 unique articles published of about 30, 1500 word count so so this are my this are the brief brief description of the of my website so now you want to go down and describe the describe your website describe i'm going to tell everything i'm going to tell people your potential bias about the website how you started the website the important details of the website how you started the website you are going to tell them about you you are going to tell them about the site you are going to tell them about the product on the site you are going to highlight the everything about the site the any potential the any or the any that you have on the on the website the business and space after say okay so i'm going to tell them everything if you have social media including everything business so i'm going to write everything in full details here 
So when you finish with that, then you click continue. So now here is where you can upload your financial attachment. So if you have if you have any ad ad report or any financial statement that your business app or your your website is making money. If it if it is not making money, you just leave it and go ahead. Okay, you could just skip this place here. If it, if your website is not making money, you can just leave here and go ahead to the next section. But if your website is making money already, you can just attach all the all the payment, all the payment reports and Amazon money, Amazon payment reports. Everything you you can attach it. Maybe the image you can attach the image to the to that area. So your list is almost ready there, and you are ready to go. So this is just a this is set price. This is an automatic. It will generate the paper evaluation will generate you some some so they suggest some price for you yes. but this one this doesn't matter at all you can just skip here and continue so we are going to set your price yeah yes we are going to set your price so you can just you can set the price that you want to sell your website yeah so if it is if it is an auction that you want to use or you want to include the asking price you can take which one you want to use as you can see i'm using an auction for this website then. so so you are going to state the the amount that you want that you want your buyers to start from so if someone wants to bid on the on the website they are going to start from from this amount here then re reserve for this website. So after the after the build on the website, so this is how much you want you really want for the for the website there. If someone wants to buy, so you just send it there. If you want it to show up for everyone to see the reserve, if you want the reserve to show up for everyone to see, so you can just take show reserve on this thing. Okay. So here is if you want to automatically accept most new bidders. So if someone bid on the on the website on the auction, so if you want to automatic automatically accept it, you can tick here. And auction duration day. So how many days do you want the auction, the your website auction to last? You can put one month, 30 days, something like that, 15 days. So I it. I want to have this for this website. So, so you can see I've added to have this. So if you want to buy, if you want to add buy it now, you can say you can set it here. Yes. If not, you can leave it at no. So yes, where you are going to set how you want to get paid. So you can get paid with escrow or paper. You choose escrow. They are going to pay you successfully with, without without being, being duped. So, escrow is one of the it's one of the best. So, if not, even use the PayPal. So, if your website has not been making money, it cost less or something like that. So, escrow is one of the one of the best method to sell your website. You can just take it. If not, you can go for the PayPal. Yeah. So, when you finish it, continue. Standard placements, you, know, you can just choose this one, this one time fee. So that you are going to pay to list your website. So you are going to pay 40 bucks for this for the listing. If you want to enhance the listing, so you want more stuff like unlimited duration. So with this my idea with enhanced, you have unlimited duration, you have a screw in place for you, you have an answer so more people are going to see your website on the platform. They are going to weekly inside to report your website. Free escrow. 
power to support. So all this in place for you. If you then if you want this the standard one, this 40 bucks, you have 30 months duration. Discount is cool. Standard rush. Include marketing listing, data integration, send this support. So that's all you get. So choose the one you like here yeah? and continue. So this one is gonna show up. That it should add more some extra option, but if you don't want to add, you can just continue here from here. So yes, we are gonna check out. So I wanna pay for the for the listing. So I'm going to enter your details here. If you have if you have some coupon, you can just place the coupon here. And if you are paying with PayPal, you can tick here. If you are paying with credit cards, you can just say I'm paying with credit card. So as you can see, I'm paying with credit card there. You can remove your card if you like from there when you finish. So you are going to scroll down here and click accept. I accept confirm that I have read and agree agree with them here and go down here and so if you have paid now that your website is now ready to to go online so if you check your website you preview your website here now so you can see our itself like on the website on the platform so this has look like to to your potential buyers so site on 13 years range so you have your site set up you have the picture of your website there on the right side the asking price is there okay so you need visitors so this everything about your website if that's you've written before okay Then the product list, what we are using the monetization method here, primary expense, revenue and profit, financial statement here, Google search analytic, and so these are the India traffic analytics. And this is, the, this is the attachment that you add to it. So as you can see, I've already get one person watching the the website. So you are going to be getting message. Okay, if you have any potential buyer to buy your website. So you are going to see all the comments here, the viewers here, the discussion here. And if, you, if somebody wants to watch, you can watch it there. So, so guys, you've come to the end of this tutorial. That's how you sell your online business online. How you sell your website. If you want to sell your website, it is easy and what you can do. You just go to the flipper and set your accounts up and you sell your website and make money. So if you have any question or anything to say about this video, Please let me know in the comment section area there. Subscribe to this channel and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.